Okay. I'm replaying most of Fortress Mountain. Because I didn't get footage of most of it. Hurry, Fountain. The fortress cannot hold for much longer. My time might be running out. Head to Fortress Mountain immediately. to those who perished in the blizzard. Car. Oh, I was probably supposed to use a dream. Yeah, whatever. Alright, I have arrived at the beginning of this path. I was told there was an emergency going on here, and I had been chosen to investigate it. People telling me about this seemed like they were in a rush, and didn't have much time to explain. So far, everything here seems pretty normal. The path ahead looks pretty cold and dangerous, though, but hey, it's not like I'm not experienced with this. You know, I should phone the guy who gave me this mission. Hello, sir. I'm at the base of Fortress Mountain right now. I have started my climb now. Good to hear, Fountain. Remember, well, that while you don't have unlimited time, it's okay to rest for a bit and regain your energy. Won't do anyone good any good if the mission fails as a result of you overworking yourself. Understood. I'll take care of myself. So what's the objective again? Your objective right now is to climb Fortress Mountain, enter the fortress, and reach its core. Once you reach it, you will need to destroy the heart. This will halt the threat from emerging and terrorizing the nation. The fortress is very dangerous, and entry is normally forbidden for a reason, but this is an emergency. There is no other choice. We needed a local candidate that had the best shot at surviving such a perilous task. We found you to be the best fit based on your prior accomplishments. Good luck out there, Fountain. Thank you. I'll do whatever I can. Fortress Mountain, Base Camp. Danger! This mountain has very challenging and unstable terrain. terrain. Platforms here have a tendency to break easily. There is a high risk of climbers becoming stuck, unable to return to safe ground. Inexperienced climbers should turn back immediately. As of recently, entities known as Dream Blocks have been showing up around the mountain. Those able to use their powers will have an easier time climbing. Know that the fortress of the mountain's peak is completely off limits. You see a sign here. This one seems strangely out of place. This map heavily uses dream blocks and their tech at a grandmaster level. As such, dream double jumps will sometimes be required. Ugh. All instances of jump will be indicated with torches like the one to the right of the sign. You may practice this tech by heading downwards. It may help to use two jump buttons to perform this. Didn't enable speed run tool. Shit, I'm such an idiot. Yeah, I'll be fine.
Fortress Mountain, Ancient Ruins. Danger! The terrain beyond this point is incredibly hostile. Climbing beyond this point is heavily discouraged. Only climbers who consider themselves Grandmaster should even consider climbing up to the Fortress Mountain. Climbers are not allowed to climb past the fortress entrance. It is strictly forbidden by law. Any surviving contest may face 10 years in prison and an unlimited fine. Okay, but the emergency I was told about should mean I'm okay to proceed, right? Oh yeah, I should give him a call again. I feel like I should get more info. Hello, this is Fountain. I'm just letting you know I made it to the mountain's checkpoint. Good, we made decent progress so far, but be careful. The climb so far is just the beginning. It's going to get a lot harder from here, so prepare yourself. Use every technique you have to surmount the obstacles. And also, watch out for the differently colored dream blocks. The mountain's aura is affected them in a way that you can serve speed dashing into them. Great. I'm starting to feel a lot less certain about this. Also, there's a warning about trespassers facing imprisonment. Is this really going to be okay? Don't worry, Fountain. Because this is a special case, you won't have to face any punishment for trespassing. The police would have to be idiots to arrest you for this task. But the police already are idiots. This isn't exactly encouraging. Look, if anything does go wrong, we'll get things sorted out. And if the worst happens, you will get competition. Alright then, thank you. So anyway, tell me more about this threat within the fortress. Oh yeah, I should tell you the story. It was kind of rude for me not to tell you earlier. Some time ago, a dreadful freezing beast terrorized this area. It plunged the surrounding area into an unrelenting snowstorm, destroying a nearby city. The locals were losing all hope. Luckily, a group of experts in sealing magic were eventually able to assist us and managed to seal the beast into a crystal heart. We then brought the fortress around the heart to delay its return and discourage travelers from approaching the heart. The beast is still powerful, but it's contained right now. But it will escape again soon if nothing is done, and it will terrorize the world again. So why not destroy the heart right away if that's all it takes to purge this beast? We tried that, but nothing we did work. We believe it is connected to some special power that none of us have. Our records show that it is very likely that you have this power. You are our only hope. Alright then, see ya! Be careful, Fountain. What do they even mean by special power? Dash, you moron. That's what they mean. Hey look, a strawberry. Hey look, who cares? We have an important task. Random strawberries, the least bar concern. But barely. Fine, if you're gonna be like this, I'll just tell you how to do it so you can waste less time here. You need to reach the end of the room without using the dream blocks and then make it back without dying. And also, 
This room requires the use of ceiling pop. This is so fucking strawberry gym floor to like put a fucking this in the middle of your text fan map. It's really funny. You know, these payphones sure are very conveniently placed. Alright, time to give him a call again. Hello, this is Fountain. I have successfully entered the fortress from the top. So what lies ahead now? Good job. Be careful, as the fortress interior is very dangerous to traverse. You should currently be in the outer section of the fortress. There may be some new obstacles, but nothing too overwhelming. The powers of the frozen beef have, however, most likely created more obstacles. Once you're past that, though, you'll reach the gauntlet. These are the toughest rooms. You make good progress so far. Perhaps you should rest a bit? Sounds like a plan, but once I'm rested, this ice monster is going down. I have some information on the dream box coming. The white ones apparently have strange properties that reverse your momentum. The pink ones are similar, but are more unstable and disintegrate easily. Oh my god, I love reverse dream blocking. Excuse me, Fountain? What are you talking about? Sometime, I wonder how different life would be if I never climbed the mountain. Ever since that feat, I've made quite a name for myself, and I feel as a result of that, I've been put in many unusual scenarios. Definitely quite exciting, but sometimes I feel like I just need some rest. It just gets a bit much for me. Sometimes I'm able to enjoy the climb by myself in my free time, but every day I feel like I'm going to be thrown in a new challenge. Had I not done all that, I wouldn't have all this pressure on me right now. I definitely feel it was for the better that I've climbed the mountain. I met so many cool friends and seen wonderful sights. Compared to what I would be going through if I had never climbed that mountain, this is definitely way better.
who ventures into this world place. The following chamber is the final one before the gauntlet. The gauntlet is comprised of the final trial of this world place. Only one capable of destroying the heart will be able to pass the trial. Goodbye. to the heart of the fortress. First, I should come call the Warden. Hello, this is Fountain. I have not reached the fortress's gauntlet. Is anyone there? Hello? Looks like I can't get through. I'm on my own now. I'll put it, this job by myself and return home. The one who ventured into this fortress. By reaching this point, you have entered the gauntlet of the fortress. These are the final trial of the fortress. Contract the blood of living spirit. They also prevent the unworthy from passing. Only one capable of destroying the heart will be able to pass the trials. You will. Your power is difficult to contain and so you will be able to use this to the end of the Goodbye. into this fortress. This room is constructed to contain very unusual beings. Venturing here is not required and is heavily discouraged. Should you wish to attempt this trial anyway, read the following information. The light blue jellyfish will not fall untrapped. The black jellyfish can be dashed through much like a dream. Good luck.
Please don't start me over. Okay, thank you. This is it. The final challenge of the fortress. It's time to destroy that miserable frozen monster once and for all. That's right. It's going down. Oh yeah, I have one more special truck that may come to you should we need it. Oh, my heart a bit. Still don't know what that refers to. Let's go. Final. I'm so fucking glad. To the one who has triumphed over this fortress. The frozen spirit has been sealed within the heart with powerful spells. We were unable to destroy the spirit, but we were able to impede it by time. But now, you are here. The fact that you have made it here proves you are powerful enough. Now, use your powers to shatter apart. This will destroy the spirit. To the one who has triumphed over this fortress, these are the individuals who played a part in the construction. The main architect of the fortress was Zaya. The ice tile set was created by Juno. The ruined tower tile set was created by Power of Eve. The tree decals were created by Spooky. The rock decals were created by Aaron H. Various other details were created by Flagpole one -off. Math music was taken from the Xenoblade Chronicles series. Playtesting a deck of feedback was given by Lucas Salmon Salad. There's a note written back though. Thank you for playing my map, and congratulations on beating it. Reaching the end is absolutely no small feat. If you have any thoughts on the map, be sure to let me know. All feedback is very much appreciated. Also let me know if you decide to take on the map deathless challenges, I'll be rooting for you. Perhaps one day I'll make a sequel map? Wow, it's easy. Zaya, uh, I, I know you're probably watching this. This map is fucking awesome. I just want to let you know. It's really good. Our death count. <laughs> Fun. All right. Thank you for watching, everybody.